Ooh. WrestleManiac, aka Madden Maniac. 11 30. I've had several, several people tell me that they wanted me to do a franchise with the New York Giants. I've had people message me on Facebook, um, Twitter, and then people comment on, on YouTube videos randomly, but we're going to do it, man. I know several different YouTubers that are way more popular than me are doing it, but we're going to do it, Dead Gummit. They've got a lot of work they need to have done to them. I'm not going to make a lot of moves the first year. I may sign a, a free agent or two. We're going to do all pro simulation style like I normally do. Nine minute quarters starting at the regular season. They've got a lot of stuff they've got to work on. Um, they're only, I want to say a 75 overall. I think that's what it just showed. Their, their offensive line is very mediocre. They've got... You know, Eli's only a 76 and he's 37 years old. Um, we've got Jonathan Stewart as our starting running back. We're going to have a backup, Saquon Barkley, um, who's going to end up, we're going to groom him to be our main guy. That's the plan. And of course, we got Odell Beckham Jr., who's going to be our fucking go to, go to, go to receiver. Um,. So, and then we've got the, uh, the Shepherd boys at receivers as well. So, we've got some stuff to build on. You know, Odell, we're going to build the offense around Odell, obviously. I mean, we kind of have to. But the problem with us is going to be pass protection on Eli, I'm thinking. And Eli can't scramble anymore. I mean, he never really could to start with. But... We're only going to commit to eight wins. I, I don't want to overcommit the first year. And to get eight wins would be a success. We got the Jags first week. So let's just go. We're just going to do like we normally do. We're going to go over the team um, player by player. And then we'll just go from there. We got Eli Manning, starting quarterback, 76. We got Kyle Loletta, who's a rookie from Richmond. Now that could be something. We got Davis Webb at 30. You know, Kyle, he's only a 71, but he's a rookie. Of course, we got Jonathan Stewart, 10-year veteran. Um, Saquon Barkley, Penn State, the rookie. That's going to be, you know. And then we got Wayne Gallman Jr., who's just a second-year player out of Clemson. And we got Shane Smith, who's the fullback. He's our starting fullback one year out of San Jose State. Sorry, I'm fighting a cold. I sound like Chucky Finster from the Rugrats. Odell Beckham Jr., you know, the, the fucking man. He's only a five. This is only his fifth year, too, is what's crazy. Sterling Shepard, um, two years. And then we got Russell Shepard at LSU. Um, then we've got Cody Latimer, um, Roger Lewis Jr., and Travis Rudolph. So we, our, our receiving core is not bad. And we got Evan Ingram, who's going to be a big, big help for us. Rhett Ellison and Jarrell Adams. So we got some good tight ends. And then we got Nate Solder at left tackle, 80. And then Nick Backton. Um, we're looking at Will Hernandez at left guard, John Greco. We got Brett Jones at center, John Jalapio. John Jerry, a terrible name. And then Eric Flowers. Our right side's pretty weak on offense. We got uh, Dalvin Tomlinson at right end. Or left in, sorry. Right in, we've got uh, Josh Morrow. We got Damon Harrison Sr., who's going to anchor our defensive tackle spot. Robert Thomas as well. Um, left outside linebacker, we got Connor Barwin, who's going to be one of our studs. Kareem Martin. Middle linebacker, we got Alec Ogletree, who's going to be a big player for us. BJ Goodson. Mark Herzlich and Ray Ray Armstrong. We got, we're got we deep at middle linebacker. Uh, Olivier, sorry, Lorenzo Carter. Avery Moss. Corners, we got Janoris Jenkins, Eli Apple, Leonard Johnson, and B.W. Webb. Um, free safety, we got Curtis Riley, Darian Thompson, see our, 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 and William Gay. Our, our defense is pretty weak. Landon Collins is solid and strong safety. And then we got Michael Thomas and Andrew Adams. Our kicker is Aldrick Ro Rosas, Rosas, third-year kicker. And then Riley Dixon's our punter. So... 
start that's just going through the roster now I'm gonna go to free agents I'm gonna try to maybe sign a defensive player um, I don't want to get Richie incognito uh, incognito <laughs> cognito I, I'm thinking about Jonathan Hankins just to give us a little depth at the defensive end spot because if you notice junior junior Galetti uh, let's let's go ahead and sign Jonathan Hankins let's go ahead and give him let's go ahead and sign him at right end he's an 84 overall um, just to give us some depth. Sign him in a one-year deal, see how he pans out. I'm going to hold off on the line. I'm going to see how they do through the first three weeks or so, three or four weeks, and we'll go from there. I'm not trying to trade off anybody yet. I don't want to do any of that stuff yet. Um, we're going to see how the squad does with what we got. So we've got a home game against the Jacksonville Jaguars. So Brandon Bortles, um, we got to cut a player. Sorry, Avery Moss. We're going to go ahead and give you the axe there, bub. Um, so, yeah, we're going to go into the week one at home against the Jags. And my goal for this season is simple. Let's just try to get eight wins. We're a 74 overall. Jacksonville's an 85. It's going to be trying because I know it's going to be – our defense is, is weak, man, especially in the secondary. So, we're going to get thrown on a lot, I'm sure. Um – Another thing I'm looking at is the right side of our line is really weak. It's like high 60s or low 70 ratings. And Eli can't scramble, you know, like Garoppolo and and uh, Mariota can on my other seasons, the franchises. Thank you all for supporting those as well. I know I got three separate ones going right now, but, you know, just trying to keep the content going. Jonathan Hankins, you know, that's a, that's a big signing for us. Cause we're already pretty, we already got a pretty solid defensive front, but they always get hurt, man. Like if you watch my San Francisco series, I'm constantly having defensive linemen and linebackers go down with injuries. So that's something I'm trying to prepare for, because I refuse to turn injuries off. I'm not going to be that guy. So we're getting ready to do this shit, baby. The New York Giants, man. This is going to be fun. This is going to be a trying series. Like San Francisco and, and Tennessee, they're middle of the road squads. Like they're low to you know low to mid eighty ratings on both sides of the ball. Um, the Giants are not. You know the Giants and the Jets both are really bad. I almost did one with the Jets, but I kept it. I picked the Giants. So here we go, baby. Jacksonville, I love them jerseys, man. Those red giant jerseys are so awesome. There's Eli. I don't know how many more years Eli's got left. 37 years old, man. There's Jonathan Stewart trying to get everybody hype. He's an 83 overall, man. 86 speed, 91 acceleration, 88 agility. So, Jonathan Stewart, let's see. See how we're doing. Plus, we got Saquon Barkley, man. That's the one I'm really trying to see how he pans out. He's a rookie. We got that rookie quarterback too, man. You never know what'll happen. And we got Saquon gonna return kicks for us from his own end zone. Oh, get it, baby! Over the left side, up to the 33-yard line. So Saquon Barkley with a nice little return there. And here come the Giants, man. Eli Manning, 37 years old, a 76 overall, 90 in throw power. And uh, 80 in awareness, 84 in, I don't know what that max is for. So here we go. We're looking at a first and 10. We're going to hand off Jonathan Stewart. And he goes down the very first play from scrimmage. <sighs> That's a good way to start, guys. So second down and 10. After uh, losing Stewart there, Saquon's going to get to start pretty quick there. Throwing on the left side to Ingram. Nice little gainer there. First down. 15-yard pickup to Evan Ingram. Second and 12 now. We're driving. There goes Eli throwing over the right side. Complete to the first. That's first down for us. Nice little big, nice little gainer there. But we end up getting held out. We're going to attempt a 48-yard field goal with Rosas. Rosas, no, nah, it's the crossbar. Come on, Rosas. Fucker. So we miss our first scoring opportunity. Here come the Jags. They're going to hand. Oh, my goodness gracious. Did you see that juke? TJ Yeldon just made me look like a fucked hard. 
Second down and 14 here. We get a sack. They're going to hand off to the left side. We ain't having that shit. Leonard Fournette's not going to get nowhere. Bar uh, was that Barlow? Second tackle for loss. They're going to play action on third and 15. Picked him off. Is that Leonard Johnson? No relation to uh, any other Johnsons. I don't I don't know I don't where I was going with that. So we get a we get a turnover. Nice job, D. I was shit talking you. Second down and eight. Here's Eli back to throw over the middle. That's complete for the first down. Give me that first, baby. Nice little completion there. We're looking at a third down and nine on the Jags 38-yard line. Eli back to throw with time in the pocket. Complete for the first down and another injury timeout. Uh, and then that was one of our guys. Of course it was. Second down and 11. Here comes Eli in the, the under center. Going to flush out of the pocket to the right side. Throw it over the right side. Complete. Another first down. So look at us making a little. That's Odell Beckham Jr. with the catch. His second catch of the game. Fourth down and goal. My dumbass said, let's go for it, Chad. Let's not get points. And I get sacked. Turn it over on downs. Stupid ass move on my part. <sighs> so on third down and 10, they're going to roll over the right. Blake Bortles. I said Brandon Bortles earlier. I'm a fucking idiot. On third and 10, completes for the first down. And it's first and ten. Here come the Jags. A little draw play and holy shit. Big gainer over there. TJ Yeldon. Again, just running all over us. First and ten here. They're going to hand off. Fake the handoff. Play action. We missed the sack. But we get the pick. Holy shit. Second interception. That was uh, Collins with the pick. That was a user pick too. Hell yeah, defense. Well, that's what's up, man. First and 10 on our own three-yard line. This is going to be trouble. We're going to hand off to Saquon Barkley up the middle. It's an 11-yard pickup for Barkley. Four, ca uh, four carries on the game. Now we're looking at a third down in inches here on our own 24. We're going to hand off to Saquon Barkley again over the right side. It's another first down. So here we go. He's getting his feet wet quick. Uh, first and 10. Eli in the under center. Throwing over the left side again. That looks like Ingram. The tight end for us. Eli, 7 of 11. Looking at a fourth down and two. We were in no man's land. Picked off. So I go for it again on fourth down, and here come the Jags. We finally bring them down. Ah, so another turnover. Third down and six. And on third and six for the Jags. We give him six. We knocked him out at the end zone, but he ended up scoring anyway. Touchdown, so it's 7-0 Jacksonville. Um, back to us now. We're on third down and two. Eli, time to throw it. Going to tar that motherfucker. Slides and, oh, my gosh, gets almost beheaded there. Looking at a second down and 10. Eli, oh, God. Go oh, complete to Shepard. Oh, that was, a, that was a Bon Jovi living on a prayer play there. Luckily, we made it happen. Third down and three here. And on third and three over the middle, that's Beckham. Odell Beckham Jr. Oh, that wasn't Beckham, sorry. That was maybe one of the Shepherds. I don't know. I'm still learning everybody. First down and 10. Here's Eli. Over the middle. Did we get that first? Was that, that was Odell again to the first and goal at the one. And now it's second and goal at the one. Eli handing off. Give him six. But a flag is on the play. And it was a holding call in our center. So we get dropped back to the 10 complete again on third and goal but we don't get enough so we're gonna we're gonna kick the field goal this time and i gotta take the points i can't rosas uh hits the field goal there so it's seven to three so we get something out of that drive holding penalty ruined the drive but second and six here come the jaggies oh man big first down there blake bortles third down and eight here Oh, nearly picked off. We hold him again. So the defense is playing good ball, man. First and 10 on our own 17. Here comes Eli over the left side. Going to throw on the run. Complete. Big gainer to... Oh, it's Ingram. All the way down inside the 10. Huge gainer for Evan Ingram. Down to the 9. 
First down and goal, four catches, 84 yards for Evan Ingram. It's third down and goal. We got sacked to get knocked back again on third and goal. Complete to Odell. What a catch. But he's a yard shy. So we got to kick another field goal. I can't miss the points, man. So we keep getting close and getting close and getting close, but we just come up short every time. So it's seven to six. So here come the Jags now. Bortles throwing that backwards pass. That's not happening. We lose, they lose seven yards on the play. Now they're looking at a third down and eight, and on third and eight, we sack him. Nice sack there uh, for us, and we're forcing him to punt. So here come, look at us, guys. We're, we're, we're hanging in. And then Eli gets picked off. Uh, so I give it right back to him. And they're going to take advantage. They're throwing over the left side. It's complete for a first down. That's a good 12-yard pickup there. Third down and two. Bortles on the play action. And look how badly we got burned. Give him six. That was Moncrief. Just just burnt burnt the fucking cleats off of us. So uh, now it's 14 to six. Eli complete over the middle on third and six. Eli threw for a, sh a fuck ton of yards, but he, you know, he's already thrown two picks. Second down and 22. We're still in the game. We just got to put a drive together, and then we get sacked. Uh, we turn it. We have to punt it back to him, and the Jags are starting to. We nearly get the sack, but you know, again, our secondary is dog poop. 16-yard pickup there, and now they they're up to the 41 now after another 16-yard pickup. And it's first and 10, play action. Bortles again over the left. Safarian with the catch. That's a big gainer. And they're in our territory already that quickly. Up, uh, They're already up 14 to 6, trying to get some insurance points here. Bortles, again, we just get smoked. Give him six. 21 to 6, man. They're starting to run away with it. Um, yeah, that was bad. So they're up 21 to six here, four minutes left in the game. We're just trying to get back in the in, into it, trying to get a score, keep it, keep it close. Eli over the right side, that's complete for a first down. So we're trying to hang in there. First and 10, here we go. We're gonna roll out over the left. Nice completion again, it looks like one of the Shepherds. And Eli's hurt. Oh, Eli. Oh, Eli. So the Rook's in. He's going to roll out to the right. Complete for the first down. Looks like Shepard again. Fumbo Ruski! And the Jags get it. So that's our third turnover. Thank you there, Shep. And we've got the ball back. They end up punting to us. Fourth and 17 here. And on fourth down and 17... We throw deep over the right side, Odell. Complete for the first down. Look at us driving, dead gummit. Trying to put together something. Three seconds left in the game. We're just trying to get a score at the end. And we're going to throw to Odell. Who f <laughs> Another fumble. And that's how the game ends. So, uh, four turnovers for us. Two picks, two interceptions. And we lose 21-6 in the opener against the Jags. But you know what? Here's the thing. We lost 21-6. But I went for it on fourth and goal instead of kicking a field goal at the first possession. And then we turned it over four times. So, I mean, twice when we were, you know, getting ready to score. We had 378 yards passing. I mean, look at our defense didn't play bad at all. We just gave those two big pass plays. But we go down in the first week, 21-6. Uh, Eli threw for a lot of yards, but threw two picks with no touchdowns. Um, Saquon Barkley, 32 yards on 12 carries. Odell Beckham. We had 200-yard receivers. Evan Ingram and Odell Beckham Jr. And Russell Shepard played good. Sterling even had a couple of catches, too. Um, sacks. Herzlich had a sack, and then Landon Collins and Leonard Johnson had interceptions for us. So the, there was some spots on defense. We just turned it over to me. We turned it over four times, and when you're the Giants, you can't, you can't do that, especially when you're playing the Jaguars. 
So, yeah, we hung in there for a minute. So, <laughs> not terrible at all. We've got stuff we can build on, though. That's the thing. And But Jonathan Stewart went down. We're going to find out how bad his injury was. It said he, went, he didn't return the rest of the game. Kramer's not excited about it. Um, let me see if we can upgrade Landon Collins after that interception that he got. So that's dope. Let's move, go ahead and move him to a run support. It moves him to a 91. So he's one of our studs on defense, man. So he's already got a pick in the first week. So again, we, the, the thing is here that I'm trying to get with this season is just building blocks. Like, see, upgrade Eli Apple to a 70, 75 there. Um, we're not gonna. I'm just, if we can get eight wins this year, I would be ecstatic with eight wins with the Giants in the first year. Moving our punter up to a 75 there. So that's you got you know it's the little things. B.J. Goodson, who's a 72, we can move him up to a 73. So whatever little takeaways we can get from each game. I mean, obviously I want to win them, but I'm also being realistic, you know. So here's the injury report. Let's see what we got. Uh, Sicoli's out 39 weeks, so he's out for the rest of the season. Sam Beal is out for several. Jonathan Stewart, broken collarbone, out eight weeks. So it's time we're going to call on Saquon Barkley early. Jonathan Stewart was injured twice in the game. He got injured on the first play, and then he got injured again. Then there was the broken collarbone. So, yeah. What do y'all think about the series? Let me know what I should do, moves-wise, that are realistic. I love y'all. Love peace and hair grease. Hit that subscribe. Woo!